Okay, this tutorial is about solving a system of equations in Excel using matrices. Um, we'll start by going to Excel View, um, normal layout, just a little easier to work with. Here are current knowns for a chip, um, 160 calories to 28 grams of food. We know that there are 9 calories per gram of fat and 4 calories per gram of sugar. Using this, we can create two equations that allow us to solve this problem. So our first equation is 160 calories equals 9 calories per gram of fat times the number of grams of fat plus 4 calories per gram of sugar times the number of grams of sugar. And 28 grams of food equals a certain number of sugar um, plus a certain number of uh, or a certain number of fat plus a certain number of sugar. And I'm going to stop on this one. Switch that up a little bit. Okay. And so then from here you can create uh, two matrices. Our first matrix being from the equation and from from the uh, x and y portion. So on the first equation we have a 9 and a 4. And on the second equation we have a 1 and a 1. We're going to multiply this by our other um, matrix of 160 and 28. Um, when multiplying these matrices together, we need to take the inverse of one of the matrices. And to do that, you need to... you I mean, in Excel, you're only able to take the inverse of one that has the same number of columns as rows. So we're going to take the inverse of the first one. So I'm going to highlight four squares and type equals M, so matrix inverse and do a first parenthesis and I need to do the array of what is and there's my array I'm going to do my second parenthesis and press shift command enter and it's going to give me my um, matrix uh, and so then we need to multiply this matrix right here by this matrix so we're going to highlight this and take the little grabber pull it down to right here and I'm going to do highlight four of these squares and go equal M matrices multiplied, M mult first parenthesis, and we're going to do one right, our first array. As you can see right here, you have to do a comma. So we'll do a, put a comma in there, and then our second matrices. And if you remember how to multiply matrices, it has to have the same number of, uh, when multiplying, the same number of rows and columns so that it multiplies through through our second um, parenthesis on there press shift command enter and it'll give us the um, the following matrices which we only needed to do it to these two numbers right here and here are the same and these two numbers right here and here are the same um, and so what this tells us is um, <laughs> that there were 9.6 grams of fat and 18.4 grams of sugar. So if you want to check this, you can do 18.4 times 4. And we'll have to do an equal sign in there too. I forgot about that. Just do a new one. 18.4 I need to do equals 18.4. 18.4 times 4, so we'll get that, and equals 9.6 times 9, and we'll make this equal this plus this, and 160. So this is an easy way to solve this problem using matrices and a system of equations. Have a great day. Screw off.